Welcome back to the Paranormal Review, and today we're going to review a, a video called Bigfoot Caught on Seek Thermal Kettle Moraine. Now, before we begin, if you haven't seen the uh, announcement, please uh, click back into my channel. Uh, make sure you subscribe as well and look at the announcement. I have actually recently moved to Utah, and there's some more details there about that. Um, also, I've started a new channel called Extreme Survival, and uh, you might be interested in that as well, so please subscribe I'll put a little link on the screen. Now, before we begin, if you don't want to hear the commentary, please click on the original link down in the description below. That way you don't have to hear me talk about it. Anyways, uh, this was uploaded March 25th, 2016 um, by someone named 2007WPI. Uh, don't expect to watch this video and see a thermal image like the Patterson and Gimlin film. I'm not sure what the thermal capture is. Could it be a nocturnal animal crawling on a tree? Absolutely. However, I've been researching in the same area for the past couple of years, and there has been some fascinating evidence that ties into what the rest of the world has seen or experienced. Could this be the head and shoulders of a bipedal mythological creature trying to hide from us? I have no idea. I'm just presenting the facts of a captured heat signature, okay? So he's not saying this is definitely a Bigfoot, but he's saying that there has been Bigfoot events here in the past as well. Okay, so the video for the first 51 seconds He's going to show us his cell phone screen instead of showing it uploaded to the actual camera or computer, you know, from the camera. I don't know why he did that. It, it just seems kind of weird to me. Um, I would rather see this instead of having this shaky screen on his mobile phone while he's recording it. I would rather see this, you know, on the actual screen, like a screen capture like I do. Uh, where we thought something spooked up. Uh, you know, big bar barn owl or whatnot. Okay, so he's kind of explaining what happened. There's not too much detail. And then he says, there's, I'll just let you listen to him as well, I guess. I was going to try to mute him so he didn't have to hear both of us talking. In the center, I, there is so right in here. A, a thermal image. And this is where this is going to come in useful, where I'm able to control it frame by frame. So I'm going to back it up a little bit. So All right, so if you look at this, there's not too much detail. I don't know if it's because it's on a cell phone or if it's because there's just not much detail on this camera that he used to record this thing. Seek. Calibrates. It takes a second to calibrate. But right in the center of the truck. Okay, so he's explaining this is a thermal camera. He talks about how the dark is heat and the white is cold. Um, and in the center, you can kind of see something there. But that could just be another tree or whatever these other dark things are. Um... I, I don't see any definite kind of a sign of a Bigfoot or a Sasquatch. Let's just keep watching this. But for me, this is not conclusive evidence of a Bigfoot at all. I mean, it could be something, but there's just not too much there to really uh, go off of. Um, also, I like this guy's uh, attitude of, oh, man, I saw a Bigfoot. Like, that's not how he is, right? He's... At least, kind of like you know what? I'm not sure what it is. It could be. It could be. It could be something else. Um, the ones that are like this is for sure a Bigfoot to me usually, you know, just reek of hoax. And the ones that, you know, he says he saw something when he was out there. Please look at the description so you can see the original link, so you can listen to this whole thing. I don't want to have him talking over. It's kind of confusing for you guys. So, anyways, you know, it's something maybe moving back there, maybe not. It's really grainy. It's not really. Uh, any details that we can really make out. So this one is just going to remain conclusive, guys. Anyways, uh, let me know what you think in the description. Please subscribe and also check out my other channel. Talk to you guys later.